Now, I've gotten lots of questions from people across the country about tonight's events. They want to know why. Why did you invite President Trump to come support the South Dakota Republican Party? They wanted to know why would he waste his time in the middle of a presidential race to go to a small, insignificant state like South Dakota? Somebody really asked me that. That conversation went south pretty quickly. Another question they asked is, is President Trump going to pick you as the most popular and favorite governor? I said, yes. So here are the facts. Chairman John Wick had this fantastic idea to bring Republicans in our state together, to rally us around our values and our principles. And I loved the idea. I told him that I would do everything I could to help him. We started discussing inviting all the candidates running to be President of the United States. Tim Scott was asked, and he declined. Vivek was invited, and he turned us down. Other candidates were asked, and all of, us all of them told us that they had better things to do. But when President Trump was invited to come be with you tonight, he said, I will be there. You see, that's why people love President Trump. He doesn't listen to consultants. He doesn't listen to the media or the political elite to tell him what is important and what his priorities should be. To him, every American is worth fighting for. No one is better than anyone else. No one deserves to be treated differently than anyone else. And he will never forget about us, the little people in the little states that are the backbone of this country. He shows up for every American, and he fights for us every single day. Now, some people can't figure out his popularity. Why are people so loyal to him? I'm convinced it's because we have never seen anything or anyone like him ever before. And we've certainly never seen anyone like him serve in public office before. He is unapologetically himself. He's real, he's genuine, he is who he is, and he never pretends to be something that he's not. And those who hate America know that he will fight every single day to stop them from destroying this country.